Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, my name is Dominique. If you're not new, welcome back. I have the Teslas of all coffee makers spin. So today I'm going to be doing an unboxing, um, which I'm super excited about. I cannot wait to just open this bad boy up and start using it. Actually having great coffee because this, this is what I've been used to. I'm pretty sure a lot of us actually drink this instant coffee and maybe even this brand. So I'm actually going to start using some real coffee beans because now I have a real coffee maker. And the one that I'm going to be using is Alma Coffee. So super excited to put these in and to actually make a real coffee cup. All right. And I have a question for you guys. How much do you think you spend on coffee? Like literally, how much do you think you spend on coffee a day? Probably like six to eight dollars. How much do you spend on coffee a month or a year? So according to Google, which I did Google it, yes I did because I know I spent a lot of money on coffee. Um, it's about 2,327 for women. And men, you spend about $400 less, which is about $1,934. That's a lot of money. Why do we do this? Because we have sucky coffee makers until now. So let's go ahead and get this thing open because I'm excited. All right. This is a really big box. And I had to go all out and get the pro coffee maker. And I'll show you what it includes, but let's first get this thing open. Ooh, this is nice. I might need some help, you guys. <sighs> oh my gosh. Dude, I can probably fit in this box. All right, let's move that out of the way. Wow, you guys. Does your guys' coffee maker come all packaged and nice like this? This is a really nice box. They definitely took time to put some thought into actually packaging it. So this looks like amazing. Okay, so this is what we're gonna do. Go ahead. Ooh, okay, I wasn't, okay. Oh, oh. This is nice. This is very well designed. Oh my gosh. I wouldn't even just use this for like, the box for like wrapping up a next present or something. Okay, what's gonna happen next? It's like, you don't know what you know what's gonna happen. Okay. All right, so on top has this right here. <clears throat> Fix my glasses. Okay, so take out the accessories, unfold the box to open, place your coffee maker, and it has it right next to the sink. So good thing my sink is right there. Um, and then follow the instructions in the app. Well, let's go ahead and do that. Normally I don't follow instructions, but I feel like I should this time. All right. Woo! This is so exciting. Oh my gosh. Okay, just please call the neighbor, don't fall. Design, you guys like I don't think I've ever been this excited to unbox something all right so here is cardboard I'm just kidding it is meet your spin coffee maker hi my name is Dominique all right let's see this is so cool okay <clears throat> owner's manual so let's go ahead and we'll get to that later it's probably going to take me a while to read all the pages. All right, let's see. So on top, you have your dirty tray and your water filter. All right, so let me go ahead and take this out. Here goes the water filter. I'm assuming after a couple of months or so, you're going to have to change it out. And then this is the dirty tray. They are both really like wrapped really nice. I don't know what this is. Okay, so, oh, it's a drip tray, drip tray. And then this right here is the water filter. I'm gonna go ahead and open it up really quick so you can see what it looks like. Oh, 
this is like some fancy styrofoam. Like seriously, I'm so used to the white one that like flakes off really fast. Okay. I am so excited. I'm just so glad I can share this with you guys. Okay. This is so cool. I feel like it's Christmas right now and I'm just opening up a present. This is really tight, kind of like when I try to squeeze into my jeans. Okay. Ugh. Please don't fall. Okay. Oh my gosh, this is sexy. All right, you guys. So what makes this the Tesla of all coffee makers? One, you don't have to buy pods anymore. Boom, you're saving money there. And did you know that they actually grind the beans six months, so it's not even fresh beans. I mean, it's not like I, I was used to that instant coffee, so I can't notice anything. But if you guys use the coffee pods, just know that you're making a lot of waste, your coffee's not fresh, and you're spending extra money. So what this solves all of those problems. So this actually doesn't use like all the other techniques that the other coffee makers, which they use like gravity or pressurizing um, techniques. What this does, it actually spins the coffee. So it grinds it, that way you have fresh beans. And then it spins the coffee like super fast where it creates pressure. And then you just have like awesomeness coming into a cup. So I haven't got to try that awesomeness now because I just opened this box but I'm gonna share my results with you guys, okay? I'm gonna share with you guys my first real coffee from home and not that cheap stuff that I was drinking before that tastes like dirt. But if you put a little bit of sugar in it, it is okay. Kind of. So this is the carafe. This is pretty much, you can make more coffee. If you don't want just a cup, you can make a ton. You can even do cold brew. And this right here, my friend, this is where miracles happen. I'm just kidding. This is the milk frother. So if you want a little bit of milk in your coffee, ooh, ooh, we're gonna use this. We know it's from Spin. All right. Ooh, this is cute. Okay, I like this. I like how that looks, so it's really nice with the countertops. Okay, packaging is pretty good. Just got it and it didn't break. So this is nice. I like, I like how it looks. And then it even has a little tip where you can pour it and you don't make any spills. Because we don't need any messes up in this kitchen. Next, this guy. Ooh. Okay, take this bad boy out. I really like the packaging. It reminds me of Apple's packaging. Just nice. And then this right here is the actual milk frother. Oh, this looks really nice. It actually looks like a mini version of my coffee maker. Just really small. And then, boom. You got thing one and thing two. So the first thing you have to do, it says it here, before you start, install the Spin app, you will need the app to set up your coffee maker. Got my camera out. Gonna go ahead. It brought me to the spin app. Oh, you know what? I actually have to plug it in to do that. So let's go ahead and do that. <laughs> I'm just kidding. All right, guys, so this is gonna be the best part. You actually get to name your coffee maker. So I'm thinking of a couple of names. If you have a great name, go ahead and comment below. Let's go ahead and just put one for now. which I'm gonna name it Sunshine. If you guys can come up with a better one, I'll go ahead and change it, but this is what I'm gonna name it because it's gonna give me some sunshine every time I wake up. <sighs> and I smell that coffee. Okay. Let's see back. Wow, that's beautiful. Start guide. Okay. Remove the water tank. Turn this around for you guys. It looks like they did it like this. They pulled it out. Push this all the way down. Okay, so fill the water to the max line. Okay, what's 
next. So place the water tank back. Very seamless experience, you guys. I have to say, this is fun. So start cleaning. Okay, so set a 16 ounce cup under the spout to catch any spillage. Start cleaning. And it's rinsing. It's telling you exactly what it's doing. I had, a, I had a water filter and I had to like do that myself, okay? So this does it itself. It's like, do you wash dishes too? Maybe it does. Oh, here we go. You have to replace the water filter every two months, okay? So, or the use of 200 liters of coffee. Updating your spin coffee maker. Downloading any updates. Again, this is the stuff I used to drink. Instant coffee. I don't even know what is this. Is this real coffee? Doesn't really look like it. This too, I'm updating to this. Locally roasted coffee. So you guys should go out there and support your roasted coffee maker companies. This is nice. It's Passion Medium Dark Roast. Then updating. So press and hold the spin button to continue. So the cool thing about this is that it's not like any other coffee makers where it pushes and crushes the coffee grind or the coffee beans and then it just has the water go through it. So you're not really getting all of the coffee. The cool thing about spin, it actually spins it um, where it's grinding the coffee beans at the same time it's also splashing water. So you're getting all of the coffee. Um, it's spinning so fast that it's creating pressure. So that's what sets it apart from all the other coffee makers. Also, there's zero waste. So once all the coffee makers are grinded, you also have your coffee, all the waste goes underneath it and it's pretty much dry. You don't have to worry about cleaning out those filters anymore. You don't have to worry about those sloppy messes after. Everything is just super clean. All right, so it looks like it's done updating. So you completed all activation steps. Your coffee maker is activated and ready to make its first cup of coffee. This is what we've been waiting for. So before we make our coffee, we actually have to scan what coffee we have. That way it uses all the specific things that the roaster pretty much says like this is what you should do to make a perfect coffee cup. So in a way, this is like a barista. It does all of the scientific stuff, it does all the hard work for you. All you have to do is just do the cup. All right, and no people, I haven't had any coffee yet. This is just my natural energy. Oh, look at that. Because we already ordered it from the marketplace, it's already in there. Oh, that's so cool. So this is what makes it the Tesla of all coffee makers. Just like a Tesla, how it always gets updates, this coffee maker does the same thing. So with the updates, it actually updates different coffee recipes. So right here, it's just giving us a couple of different ideas, recipes. So these ones are all new. So if we ever wanna try any of these. So this is pretty awesome. First, put the coffees in there. This is my first time opening a coffee bag. So I never had this experience ever. You just pour it in there. The moment of truth. The moment we've been all waiting for. I want, you know what? Let's just get an espresso. Let's just do it. Passion roast, make drink. Oh, this is so cool. So it actually lets you know what's happening. It's grinding. I can hear it now. It's spinning. Mmm. That's some real coffee right there. Coffee is ready. Hmm. This smells like, kind of has like a nuttiness smell to it. it smells really good. 
Oh my gosh, this is so good. That was so good. I am so hyped right now on coffee. I literally just had an espresso. Woo! I feel really good right now. This was freshly roasted on the 25th, five days ago, right now. Come over here, come over here. It's blinding. You can see where it's going down. That is so awesome. And now it's spinning. So this is what it's doing. It's going like this really, really fast. Okay, that was so delicious. I didn't even have to put sugar. I didn't even have to put any milk or any coconut milk or any keto milk, any of that. It was just, it was like delicious. There you go. I'm super excited to wake up every morning knowing I'm gonna have fresh coffee. I'm just so excited to start making customized drinks, saving money, because I no longer have to go to Starbucks or to any other coffee shop. I'm gonna save so much money, so that 2,300 or whatever, I'm gonna be keeping in my pocket. Um, but yes, I can't wait to like give you guys an update, a review, so just wanna thank you guys. Wanna thank you guys for just watching my videos. Hopefully you like it. If you do, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't done so already. Make sure you guys also leave a comment below. I wanna know what kind of coffee you would recommend. Again, this is my first real coffee, not the instant coffee. So if you guys have any good recommendations, go ahead and comment below, because I definitely wanna try them out. Um, especially if you're in the marketplace. If you guys have a coffee maker, if you have a spin, let me know what your favorite recipe. And if there is another coffee maker that's out there that you think is the test of all coffee makers, go ahead and comment below. I want to know. All right, you guys, we had a really good relationship. Um, you know, it's been a couple of years, but you guys aren't giving me the flavors that I'm looking for, so we have to worry that. Bye. Don't, no, don't say anything, Insta. Don't say anything. Bye. Spin, hold on.